Dr. Smith has a candle that he is going to ignite, place in a jar, then swing in a circle. Centripetal force is what keeps the lit candle moving in a circle. Now look closely at the flame of the candle because it is pointing in the direction of centripetal force. It does not matter where the candle is in the circular path. The flame is always pointing toward the center of the circle. Centripetal force is always directed toward the center of the circular path of motion. Centripetal force is always directed toward the center of the circular path of motion. And I'm doing a demonstration on the effect of centripetal force on the candle flame. My demonstration consists of a rotating record player and a support for three candles that will be lit. These candles will be covered by a glass dome which will eliminate all the outside airflow to give my demonstration a more accurate result. Centripetal force is always directed toward the center of the circular path of motion. Centripetal force is always directed toward the center of the circular path of motion. It can be clearly seen that as the rotation speed builds up, the two outer candles point inwards, whereas the center candle stands straight up. Centripetal force is always directed toward the center of the circular path of motion. Centripetal force is always directed toward the center of the circular path of motion. Centripetal force is what keeps the lit candle oh, moving in a circle. Ooh. Now look closely at the that flame of the candle because it is, really is pointing in the direction of centripetal force. It does not matter where the candle is in the circular path. The flame is always pointing toward the center of the circle. Centripetal force is always directed toward the center of the circular path of motion. Now look closely at the flame of the candle because it is pointing in the direction of centripetal force. It does not matter where the candle is in the circular path. The flame is always pointing toward the center of the circle. It can be clearly seen that as the rotation speed builds up, the two outer candles point inwards, whereas the center candle stands straight up. Now look closely at the flame of the candle, because it is pointing in oh, the no. direction of centripetal oh, force. It does not matter where the candle is in the circular path. The flame is always pointing toward the center of the circle. Now look closely at the flame of the candle because it is pointing in the direction of centripetal force. It does not matter where the candle is in the circular path. The flame is always pointing toward the center of the circle.
can be clearly seen that as the rotation speed builds up, the two outer candles point inwards, whereas the center candle stands straight up.